I am super excited about this one. We are going to make the rock, paper, scissors game. And we will make a two-player game for this one. It will be very fun. This one's going to take a little bit longer than the other two activities, um, the speed boost and make music from keyboard input challenges. If we go over to here, we need a rock. Um, that is an excellent version of a rock, but we aren't going to use that. So there's a rock. I like the mossy rock. Oh, I'm going to use this one. Rock. But I only want the one rock. Um, so I'm going to, you can leave it be. I just am going to be real picky right here. And I am going to crop out anything other than the one rock image here. Crop. Um, and I'm going to erase this a little bit. Yes, I'm that picky. You can draw your own rock if you want. And then paper. I don't know if there's a paper. Oh, I love it. There's already paper. And scissors. There's no scissors. <sighs> okay, we're going to draw our own scissors. This is not going to be pretty. You are 100% free to laugh at me after you see my version of what scissors look like. I'm going to pick like a grayish color, I guess. Um, oh, wow. Um, <laughs> uh, and then they just like have a line I want to say wow don't laugh you can laugh it's okay I won't cry my my drawings are not great I am not super good at drawing but I try and that's all that matters. Yes, my scissors are awful, I apologize. But you get the idea that it's scissors sort of, right? <laughs> I think you think these should be touching each other. That's okay. We're just gonna name it scissors and not show Miss Johnson. Okay, on my screen, I need one for player one and one for player two. I might actually, I'm going to throw a draw loop and a draw sprites in here and just get set up over here. And I'm going to say player one, player two. Oops, player one, player one. And I have to pick one. I'm just going to start with rock to begin with. And then... Player two, player, whoops. Player two, and I'll start that one with rock as well. They're both in the middle. They're kind of big, so I'm going to scale all of these down to, I got to spell it right, player one, 0 0.5. Player 2, 0 0.5. I want player 1 to show up on this side and player 2 over here. So I'm going to move this one over to 75 and this one over to 325, I guess. And we have 2. That works. Now, I'm going to start them. We'll leave it visible for now. We don't need to make this so complicated. But what we want to do is allow the people playing to make their choices. So you can have one person use number keys or arrow keys to make their choice of rock, paper, scissor, and the other person um, have their choice. So this is just going to be a bunch of if blocks. So an if and a key down and based on which key is down, we're going to set to their animation. So I'm going to start with player one. If they press uh, the W, I'm going to have to type that in, the W key, then it will do rock. And I'm going to copy that. Um, 
And I'll say if they press the A, it will be the paper. And if they press D, it will be scissors. I'm going to check it now. So W, S, uh oh. Oh, I need a white background. This is why we check our work. Fill the background in with white. Run. Okay. Uh, rock, paper, scissors. <laughs> Sorry, my scissors are very silly. So now that I have um, my one player going, I can set my other player. Um, I'm going to use just keys on the other side of the keyboard. You can use whatever you want. I'm going to do... Um, if one player is using their fingers on this side, I guess I would have the other player use the other side, which would be like I, J, and L, or the up, down, and left arrow keys. That's really up to you what your choice is. I'm going to do player two being um, the I, J, and L, or no, the up, let's do the arrows, up, and it's player two will be rock, left player two is paper, and right player two is scissors. And now all of a sudden I have two draw sprites and I don't need those. All right, let's try our code. So we both start with rock. So then we're going to say that's scissors, paper, rock, scissors, paper, rock. All right. Now you could pick one person near you and actually play on the same keyboard together and see who wins versus your game. You do not need to keep score. Um, and it's not a perfect game. This is just a prototype, okay? So that is that code.